Many drivers are experiencing a longer morning commute. Heavy traffic on the H1 westbound was caused by repair work on a guardrail. But the DOT also has several other projects this week, advising drivers to allow plenty of extra time. Max Rodriguez reports. It's a busy day on the road. Drivers saying they are bumping into road work at every turn. There's always construction on the road or wherever. The Hawaii Department of Transportation says there are several improvement projects taking place on the H1, including viaduct repairs near the airport off-ramp. That is going to be a two to three lane closure. Um, the next one for that, it would be this weekend, uh, starting this weekend from Friday night into Monday morning. Tuesday morning drivers hitting a rough patch of traffic when reaching Middle Street. Safety repairs were needed to the guardrail. Traffic bumper to bumper for a few hours. It took people about um, 55 minutes to get through the area. The good news is that that project was completed. Although nighttime drivers should keep in mind a full westbound closure of the H1 is taking place this week between the University Avenue interchange and Alexander Street for resurfacing of the freeway. Drivers will be needing to take detours. Got onto Baratania and Baratania was backed up all the way until I got to um, uh, Queen. Queens Hospital side and I took the freeway from there. The DOT says there's been more work added on the freeways with an increase of federal funding. With the bipartisan infrastructure law, we did receive um, about 20% more f federal formula funding. So we have been able to do more projects. The Hawaii Department of Transportation releases a weekly lane closure schedule to better help drivers plan their commutes. The department says a lot of the repairs will take place on days when the weather allows. Max Rodriguez, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.